Uh, hello and welcome to Hukalo TV. We're live. It is um, Thursday, May 30th, uh, roughly 9.30 p.m. Eastern Time. And uh, James Charles has been channeling Ish, who has some uh, important announcements for us. Ish? Greetings. Actually, it's Tuesday, my dear boy. Oh, but gee. anyway. <laughs> my eyes are not what they used to be. <laughs> it's all right. I just wanted to address you all very shortly about a very important uh, event that has happened. Now, I don't want to draw any fear to it, but I do want to draw your great concern to it in the sense that you can help it in your own particular way. There has been an event that happened on Antarctica recently. I won't go into dates and details, but I do want to tell you that the timeline has been affected and that uh, there are th things in the atmosphere that shouldn't be there. There always was, but there's more of them there now than ever before. So I need all of you to concentrate your healing efforts to Mother Gaia and, and to the atmosphere and to the timeline. Now. Let me be a little bit more specific. Those of you out there who have healing modalities, modalities such as Reiki, Joe Ray, or any of these things, even some uh, of you have healing effects that are not on the um, uh, modality page but have been attuned by your own thoughts processes that you do have energy that can be sent out we ask you to do so as much as possible within the next few weeks we need the atmosphere mother gaia and the timeline to be cleansed and so therefore we need all your help we need as many people as possible to be doing this as often as possible. Now, if you do not have a healing modality, if you do not have any way to send healing, please let one of us know, me or Astrid or Angie or David or anyone that you know who has a healing modality that can be taught to you immediately uh, it would be wonderful that you did that right away. Now, if there is some kind of procedure that needs to go with it, su such as a frequency healing or an attunement or anything of that nature, please let us know. We must get this done as quickly as possible. Now, you may not think that this is that important, and I do not want to strike fear in you at all because it is not something that is necessary. But we need to all work together as quickly as possible to get this done. If there are any questions, please let us know in any way that you can through email to Jim or, um, and he will set out to answer as many of these questions as possible, I'm sure, or perhaps send them to other people to answer for you. You may not get an answer from him, but you may get an answer from someone else. Now, I'm trying to be very clear, but I think that I have stumbled over some of these uh, things. So I want to repeat something to you very quickly. If you have a healing modality, use it for healing the timeline, the atmosphere, Mother Gaia, or whatever. If you do not have a healing modality or a way to send healing to Mother Earth, please get in contact with someone, one of us here, that may have some information on how to do that. And we will be able to get you attuned and able to help you to be a part of this great and universal cause. I love you all very much, and today is a wonderful day, and we must continue to work for, look forward to a greater and more wonderful world. 
We are here in the midst of the ascension, here in the midst of a great deal of positivity, and now and then something negative will happen, and we will take care of it as quickly and as easily as possible. Take care of yourself, and please get in touch with one of us if you have any questions. Once again, if you have a healing modality that you are aware of, such as Reiki, and you've been attuned to any portion of it, or Joe Ray, or any kind of healing modality whatsoever, that you can send energy to Mother Earth, the timeline, and the atmosphere, please do so, and do it often. Thank you very much for your time and your patience. I love you all very much, and if we work together, there will not be any problem whatsoever. But we must be quick to respond to any kind of emergency that Mother Gaia may foresee as a possible problem. So therefore, we are responding quickly, and we are going to handle it most efficiently. Much love to you. Thank and you. I will be with you. Is there anyone else that wants to speak a word of wisdom? Have I forgotten anything? Well, could I just ask one question? one question? You stress yes. learning new healing Please. modalities. What about prayer? Most people have a way of praying already. Prayer is most wonderful. And meditation. Healing modalities can do cleansing in the atmosphere, the timeline, and Mother Gaia. But if you are praying for cleansing of these things, works just as well. But there are ways that you can reach out and use other modalities for larger areas, faster, more efficient ways. Prayer is absolutely a wonderful way to go, though. You never can doubt on God. He is always steadfast and listens to everything. So therefore, if you have no modalities, use that one until you do. And then you can still use that one, of course. <laughs> Any other questions? I am wondering from a standpoint of um, as far as uh, our friends up there, as well as the Elohim and um, and others, are they what are they able to do to assist? Because I'm sure they're actively working. Oh, absolutely. They are assisting in whatever ways that are legal for those outside of your world to do so. The one thing you must remember is that your people have caused this problem. And so your people must respond and heal this problem. Those outside of your world may be concerned, but are not allowed to be hands-on on situations like this. So take it upon yourself, even though it may seem unfair that you are put in this position, but you must help your people heal your planet. Uh, thank you, and with to piggyback on that, I know that a lot of people are going to wonder what happened, and I know that um, that you can't go into specific details. But what can we say to kind there of give a little event. more credence? There was an event in an, the Antarctic area, and it was an event of a very grand scale, and it sent shock waves through the Earth, not only through it but above it and around it, and these shock waves can be effectively dangerous. But if you put your mind and your healing modalities and your energies into healing your planet and your atmosphere and your timeline, you will be effective and have been effective. There are many that are already working on this problem and have been somewhat successful. But we need a lot more people and a lot more energy dedicated to the problem if we are to heal it in the right amount of time. 
Wonderful. Thank you. We want to focus our attentions on Gaia. Yes, and the atmosphere and the timeline. All of the above. Because it's not just one, but all have been affected. Okay. It was beautiful to talk to you. And I want to send out a prayer of beautiful success and energy to you. May you be filled with love and pray to God that he intervenes as well. I know that yes. he will if you ask nicely. <laughs> Understood. Much love to you. And have a wonderful evening. Thank you. thank you. Much love to you, and thank you for sharing this message. And thank you for being there to help us deliver it. My thank pleasure. You. Absolutely. And with that, we will go off the air. Thank you for watching Hukalo TV.